Hey there everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're a first time watcher and subscriber, great to have you here. Thanks for coming on by. So today I have a, uh, a review of, uh, I did a review of one of their candles back in uh, January. They're a fairly new company to the market. Um, they came back out in uh, December of 2017 and that is Otherland. Show them that right there, get the box here. So this is their spring collection, right? So they have five cents in their core collection. Um, and then they did, about a month ago or so, they did a artist-inspired collection, or candle, single candle there. And um, so the company, uh, the CEO, Abigail Stone, um, she does great things. Check out her Instagram. She's very, very involved with the company, hands-on. Um, from what I can tell, I believe these candles are hand-poured um, from some of the photos that I've seen uh, her post there. So let's, uh, let's get into it here. So here we have... Uh, this is a three pack there so it comes with uh matches this is the spring collection right so this is the brand new spring collection just came out about a few weeks ago or so box smells amazing um i've had i've had this for a little bit of time i wanted to really smell them and get into it there uh and not rush to judgment because these are kind of complex scents but this does come with an every candle purchase it comes with a little box of matches um so we have the little multicolor there it says Spring 2018 collection and Otherland on the other side there. And for states that can't have matches shipped to them, I think they do like mints or something like that. Because um, you can't air mail these, I guess. I don't know what that is. but uh, So we have three cents here. And their normal collection um, <clears throat> is, a, is a white vessel. So this is what the size of them are. The, their normal collection is just a white vessel with a, a label on it here but here we have sort of like it's transition from white to dark on all of them uh we call that ombre or whatever you want to call that there but so the spring collection only has three cents in it but they tell a theme and i will tell you what that theme is um once i get over this there so interesting to note these are eight ounce candles now they they use a uh they're not 100 soy they're not paraffin but they use a coconut wax blend and by this is super strong and smelling it right now. Um, when I burned their kindling uh, scent back in, in uh, December or January, I, like, like I said in my review, that was one of the most authentic fire scents I have smelled. And I was very impressed with the wax quality. Uh, I wasn't getting a lot of soot. I wasn't getting like, it wasn't turning colors on me. It was, you know, it was just very nice. It's, it's a white, white wax there um, with the glass so good with the glass um vessel there with the sticker that says otherland on the front there the other ones the core collection has the name of the scent on the side i believe i could be wrong i forgot i'd have, I'd have to pull mine out but anyhow um so this is ruby root they call it the ruby root and it has notes of sugar beets grass and ginger and what they like to say this one has fancy dirt in it and it does it's it's got um, an earthy sensation to it. It's got a little bit of a cooling note to it, but it's very grounded. It's very earthy, um, grounded there. Now, the sugar beets um, have a little bit of a sweetness to it, so it's not um, tart. It's not sour. It's, it's a sweeter scent on there. That, there's a cooling note, sort of like a, like a eucalyptus or a menthol. I'm not sure if that would be coming maybe from the ginger on this. Not that, not the grass for sure. Mm. Yeah, very good. So this one we start with the, the morning, right? So this is like your morning scent, how they're gonna go with it, and then we go into midday, and this one is purple petals. Now this one, oh, oh. so purple. I love floral scents if they're. Not overly heavy. I, I like garden florals. And this one, when I smelled it, I was like, bam, this is going to be my favorite. Um, and it is. I have searched high and dry for a really good, hyacinth-scented candle. And they just don't make them until now. <sighs> Man. So this has, it's all purple, white flowers. Lilac, hyacinth, and lychee. Forget the lychee, you know. Um. We're talking uh, lilac and hyacinth in this candle, and it's got a gorgeous purple transition there. 
eight ounces. They at least have about 40 hour burn time on them, uh, if I'm correct there. So this one, if you like florals um, that aren't overly perfumey, that aren't heady florals, if you know what I mean, you know, uh, it's not very strong. This this would not uh, induce headaches to me. This is not a headache inducing floral, at least to me. I love hyacinths. I've loved hyacinths ever since I was a kid. I don't know what it is about them, but I don't know if it's just because of the, the flower, you know, the tall flower and put one in your house and within an hour you're smelling the whole thing. Uh, so that this to me is my favorite out of the three. If I had to pick one, this is my favorite out of the three. They're all they're all very, very good. Don't get me wrong. Uh, and this box, by the way, they come in. You can buy them single or you can buy a three pack. If you say uh, you buy a three pack, you save money. Um they're packed nicely. I'll show you this. How they're packed. They're, this is a thick, thick foam that they're packed in. So they, it's very nice. They're not gonna, they're not gonna come out. You gotta really, really work them out. So it's a very good, very very good storage. And the last one we have in the collection here. This one is called Extra Hour. So this is your nighttime candle, right? So, okay. So the, the story. Of these three fragrances it takes you throughout the course of a day you're waking up you've got the earthy scents in the middle of the day the flowers are blooming you're energized everything like that and then nighttime you're sitting back you're having a drink you're talking to friends you're having a little party a little cocktail party that's what uh, extra hour is about so there is your green transition there and they'll have matching color matching lids there so this one has, and this is an interesting one, uh, Shisha Leaf, Verbena, Verbena, and Mint. This is, it's not heavy on the mint, but the mint is there. It's a cooling mint. Um, not like a, it's, it's, think of like a green, like a greenery smell, and then the mint. So... Uh, straight up mint. We're not talking a peppermint. Maybe more along the lines of a spearmint. We're talking on this one, but it is just it's it'll relax you. It's it's just a nice aroma to have in the air. And this wax is this wax is outstanding. This is great wax. Wicks are all centered. Uh, one thing to note is that these are um, cardboard and they have a little rubber thing in there. So you most certainly do not want to just pop it on there when it's lit. It'll burn. You want to blow it out uh, or dip the wick. I'm a wick dipper. And then just um, let it cool down and then put the lid on. Um, that's what you want to do. And on the bottom, of course, it has all these safety things. You know, never leave a burning candle on a tent to keep away from children, pets, things catching on fire. Do not, and it says right here, do not replace topper until candle has fully extinguished. So, uh, so that is that. They are made in New York and Brooklyn. Check them out. I will give you a link. Uh, below in the, in the uh, description to where you can find them. Um, they are $36 shipped for one, um, but the, the packaging is amazing. Uh, all three for $89, and that includes shipping as well. So, like I said, if you get all three, you do save money on them. Highly, highly recommend uh, this company. Cannot say enough good things about um, the founders and everything like that. So, they're very involved um, they're hands-on with the product. So, um, check them out. Like I said, Otherland, it's otherland.com, but I will put a link below in, in the description there so you can check them out. Check them out on Instagram and Twitter as well. Um, they're always posting some cool things there. Uh, I assume we're going to be getting a fall lineup from them, uh, hopefully soon, maybe August or so, maybe. Um, I put my request in for a good Halloween candle. Uh, here's hoping. You know, but uh, if not this year, maybe next year. Uh, so, uh, okay, guys. Well, that's what I have for for you right now. Let me know. Have you tried uh, other than before? Uh, like I said, they're only about a six-month-old company. So, um, they haven't been around for a while, but they're getting very, very good reviews all the way around. And they've been featured in multiple uh, magazines and websites. So, uh, check them out. You know, uh, give me some thumbs up on the video. Comment, like, subscribe. Um, I thank you for coming by, and I will uh, see you real soon. So, thanks, and have a good one.